Hey guys, this is Claudia here from the Bookkeeping Experts. I've been a bookkeeper for a long time and I have people coming up to me with all kinds of questions. Today we're going to cover how to change the view settings in QuickBooks Online. Um, a lot of accountants may be telling you something uh, to go here, go there, but you're not looking at the same thing. So it's like talking Greek. So how do you change that? And for you accountants, the same way. You may take a look at your um, customer view and it might look completely unfamiliar. This has been changed recently with Quick QuickBooks Online. And the reason why it's been changed is because a lot of people using desktop is now migrating to QuickBooks Online. And QuickBooks engineers are working on making it look, the interface, make it look as much as possible as the desktop. All right, so let's just go around and take a look at what's the uh, interface like. Okay, on the left-hand side, um, we have first things to do. This is what you're going to be working on for most most part okay and it has a workflow for that so you can add your products and service manage customers create estimates send invoices and keep in mind is a like a workflow a workflow track time manage payroll right um and for money out for entering bills so you're gonna pay bills uh enter bill pay bills and things like that okay so Business overview, uh, you're going to have like a view of how your business is doing. So we have some graphs here. Uh, we have the reports right over here. All the reports available right over here. Uh, planners and projects if you have QuickBooks Plus or Advanced. Uh, on banking, you'll be able to um, use QuickBooks Online Funding. You can actually um, connect your bank account and also request uh, funding and things like that. Apply for a loan. Uh, you even have access to PPP Center if you have the loan through QuickBooks Online. All right, so get paid. Um, here you're going to see um, invoices. You can send a link to your customers so that they can pay you or you can create invoices. Um, and you can add your products and service and you can also pay through vendors and things like that all right so payroll if you have payroll is right through here and bookkeeping is where you would categorize transactions uh, it's kind of like banking and accounting right and taxes you have uh, your sales tax and your payroll taxes and your apps is right here all right so uh, if you want to add um, some bookmarks in here, you can. So you can add the book bookmarks and go to the places you always go. It become more familiar with those places. Um, now, if you don't like this view, you can change that. Like I said, that's what we're talking about today. You can click on the gear menu, click on switch to accountant view. Okay, this is the more familiar view, right? So the difference are just a few. So here, for instance, is banking, which is um, where you, you see in the uh, customer view, but it just looks a little different, right? All right, I'm going to close this. I like to work on the accountant view because we can see all the transactions. We can match, add, whatever we need to do, but we see everything here on the business view it's a little different okay so if you go to get things done or uh, bookkeeping where you categorize transactions you click on review categories and you only go one at a time that could be a little you know it's supposed to be uh, more user-friendly but if you like to do things a little faster, I I like the accountant view better. But then it's my personal preference. And that doesn't mean that uh, you need to have the same preference that I do. <laughs> all right. So once again, so it's all in there, but it looks different. It kind of have a different feeling to it, 
but it's all in there. It's just, you know, it's kind of like somebody coming over and cleaning up your house and replacing everything or reorganizing everything. And everything is still there, but you just don't know where, the, where everything is. So you just have to go through and kind of explore a little, a little more. Like I said, on the plus new on the very top, most of the tra the the transactions that you, you usually do will it's going to be here. So it's going to be the same thing um, either on the business view or the accountant view. So if we change it back, the plus new is exactly the same. So you still have the invoices, you know, the sales receipts, expenses, employees, all all the stuff is right over here. Okay, so right over here on the plus new, all transactions that you need to enter. But you can also um, do it differently. So there's different buttons to get to the same place. So, But that's how you change it. So very easily switch back and forth if you'd like to become familiar with both of them. Or if you have a preference, stick to it. <laughs> but most importantly is to be able to understand and feel comfortable with, with whatever, whatever interface you prefer to use. Once again, if you, um, if you are a business owner that um, like to do your bookkeeping, but you're stuck on something and you'd, you'd need somebody to tell you what to do, please feel free to contact us today. I'll leave our contact down below. Uh, and if you actually need somebody to do a little bit more, maybe ongoing bookkeeping, contact us as well. We offer both services. So regardless of what you need, just give us a call or just send us an email and we can help you out with that. You can hire us for a Zoom meeting uh, to teach you how to do it or we can just go ahead and do your bookkeeping so you can focus on doing what you like and what you do best. And we're going to do what we like and do best, with, which is your books. All right. Well, thanks again for taking the time to watch this video. We are, we're going to come back in a constant basis. So if you like this video, remember to click on the thumbs up there and subscribe to your channel, to our channel, <laughs> so you can receive the most updated material on QuickBooks Online. Once again, thanks for watching and until next time, Keep on smiling.